Hi guys, how are you doing? In this video, I'm going to show you a get ready with me. As you can see, my hair is in a mom bun. And I just want you to get ready with me. So the first thing I'm gonna do is the Makeup Forever. So I have had this for over two years. Not even playing, it's such a good one. I used to use a foundation, but then my face got cleared up and my skin got so much better. So now I just need a little bit of, you know, a little bit of that. So the next thing I have here is the L'Oreal Liquid Eyeliner, Carbon Black. I've also been using this for years. I mean, not like this one specifically, but um, this type of eyeliner. It's just so awesome. I have still not learned how to do the eyeliner wing, but one day I will learn. And my next one is the Maybelline Brow Definer. I will also put the links on the comments below. Any ladies watching this video have microblading eyebrows tattooed? How did it go for you? How do you like it? Does it save you a lot of time? I think it would be so cool to try it out. I get my my eyebrows threaded and I like them so much better than waxing because every single time I wax I always break out so what do you guys like do you like threading or waxing And this one's pretty cool because it has this like round tip here and sometimes when I use like different ones this part breaks off but this one is like very sturdy. Um, I actually, I, this is my first time using this one but my favorite, um, my favorite eyebrow pencil is the Anastasia and I will also comment, we'll put the link on the comments because that one is my absolute fave. I actually just tried this, it works okay, but I like the Anastasia one better. And then, um, I have the Becca, it is Becca, the Shimmering Skin Protector Mineral Blush and Champagne Splits. So it's actually like a highlighter and a blush. It looks like this. And the good old faithful MAC brush. Okay, I've had this for over 10 years. It's still going strong. You make that investment, you know, kind of goes strong. So, and then for the highlighter, I use this type of brush by Bare Essentials. Put it just like on my nose a little bit. And a little bit on my cheekbones. Gives a little shimmer. So now for the mascara, I just use the L'Oreal Paris Voluminous. So what you will learn about me is how basic I am. You can see how easy my makeup is, but I do want to try the eyelash extensions. I think those are beautiful. So what'd you guys do today? This morning, I went to, 
a yard sale. There was a community yard sale in our neighborhood and I got some good finds. I was able to find a Halloween costume for my boys and it was awesome. So anyways, so that is literally how my makeup is. I can um, do my makeup in less than five minutes because I have two boys and I have to get them ready in the mornings. And then now I'm gonna show you my hair. Okay, so this is my length hair here. And this is my length hair. Okay. And I have the Bayless, Babyless. Um, curling iron I think this is like an inch and a half but this is the best curling iron for my length hair because I have another size and that one is really good if my hair is longer but since my hair is this length um, this curling iron works best for the beach waves okay so pretty much I just if you want the beach wave look you, this is how you have to curl it, okay? So you start it on the top and then you work your way down, okay? If you start from the bottom and work your way up, you actually get the Shirley Temple curl and that's so, and you'll see here that I don't curl every single strand because I have to be able to get ready super fast. And so I let my hair air dry today and then after it air dried I put my hair in a bun so that's why it looks kind of like crazy right now the reason why I kept turning around is because I was filming and getting ready while my son was napping so I kept thinking is he awake but he was fine and still sleeping so I know it's a good idea to get rest while our kids are sleeping, but what do you mamas like to do during nap time? Let me know in the comments below. Also in the comments below, can you let me know what you like to do for self-care? I'm very curious because I need to be better at that. Once you get your curl, you just put your fingers through it. So this is literally the best curling iron. I will comment, I will uh, put the link on the comment below because I feel that maybe it doesn't damage your hair as much but I mean of course it's still a hot iron going on my hair every single day but there's probably something to really protect it and then I literally just do the top like the second to the top layer and then I'm all done So some tips on getting ready for mom life. I have one of my friends, she suggested that she actually gets ready in her kitchen because it's a good view of the kids playing and she's able to get ready. So I do that sometimes, but I'm getting ready in my room today because I'm able to. So that's nice. Okay. So. That is my hair. See? See how fast that was? Super fast. And this curling iron was what did my hair. So when, whenever I feel like there's like some pieces that needs to be 
out. Start from the bottom and then work your way down and then leave a little piece of hair there. Okay. So if you are new here, thank you so much for watching, guys. It means a lot. And um, please hit the red subscribe button for more videos I will be posting every single week. And thank you so much for watching.